Hi guys, we're from U3. Our group will demonstrate about making an improvement of cooking lontong sayur using stopwatch time study. So, quick background, lontong sayur having strong relation with Idul Fitri, which are the biggest event that Muslims done once a year. This means that lontong sayur can be said one of the most important food for those event especially. So, here is the tutorial of making delicious lontong sayur. Wait, 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 wait. I see there is something wrong with the process of cooking the lontong sayur. And this will result in... Wasting time. <laughs> now, let's help Kari to analyze the problem of her cooking. The main problem we encountered in the existing process was the insufficient operational processing time, particularly in the grinding operation, which took excessively long. There are also another problem in this existing process. To address this issue, we decided to analyze the 5S principles. The 5S principles are a set of lean manufacturing techniques aimed at improving workplace efficiency. Let's see how they were applied to improve the cooking process of lontong sayur. Firstly, we tackled the cutting operation. In the existing process, cutting the coyote consumed a significant amount of time. By streamlining the cutting process, we reduced the time taken to cut the coyote and enhancing overall efficiency. Next, we focus on cutting the tofu and chicken. In the previous method, these ingredients were cut separately, resulting in additional time consumption. To optimize the process, we combine the cutting of tofu and chicken in one place and at one time. Moving on to the grinding operation, which was a major bottleneck in the existing process, we identified the need to automate the process of grinding onions and chilies. By incorporating an automatic blender into our workflow, we significantly reduce the time required for grinding onions and chilies. This not only improved efficiency, but also ensured a consistent texture and quality of the ingredients. As you can see, by implementing these changes, we were able to achieve a considerable reduction in operational processing time. And here are the standard tools, materials,